بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله تعالى وبركاته معكم حذيفة من أبطال حسب البرامج Today I will be showing you how to use a PDF printer I'll begin showing you the, the old one So this is the old one when I press the printer do PDF when I choose a regular printer and I just say press OK I won't be getting any settings or any other parts to choose the quality or the color or anything if I just press OK it Im immediately will be printed okay but in, in this uh, software when I press OK I'm getting this I have to fix the, the, the file, the quality, I have to choose the destination every time. So there is another software that when, when I just press the printer and I say OK, it will be printed on PDF immediately and show me a sample of the file that I printed. So let's begin installing this software. You can just uh, Google it. It's called uh, ball zip. Ball zip. This one. So I guess it's actually free. I'm just going to click the website and download it immediately. All these uh, versions will work on PDF printer. Okay. The size and everything. So I already downloaded it before. This is the program. So I'm just going to double click it. Let's begin. You can choose the language. Terms and services. Okay. Uh, the last file is actually just like uh, Adobe Reader or Foxes Reader. It's just a PDF reader. I don't need it. Okay. And this uh, file is like for controlling the PDF, having like more tools and all of that. I don't need it. But this one, this one actually is very important because the language that you're going to use to print, it might be Arabic, English, or any other language. So this one actually is very important. You cannot install uh, all zip without this file. Okay. So I'm just going to press on finish. So now let's begin and test in our printer. First I'm going to control panel. I will be choosing device and printers or I'm just going to search for it printer it's all the same I'm going to set my default printer to both zip you won't be getting these four choices because I just installed it and uninstalled it a couple of times so it's not a big deal, just choose anything. Okay. Now this is my default printer. Then I will go here and do some configurations for the printer. I'm just going to type bold zip. As you can see, it gives me the bold zip options. Okay, you can check here. 
do whatever you want whatever is necessary for you the dialogues I would say never I don't want to see any dialogue I just want to print it directly okay when I print it you will find the file in desktop okay document you can change the size or whatever email image watermarks remove the watermarks from some photos you know okay you can also remove this if you want yeah if you want to show the file after you create it you can just choose ask or yes or no for me I usually just uh, choose no because the file will be here and I can check it whatever I want but this time just for just for you I will choose yes and then, then press ok now let's see what happens I'm printing now ok let's see Bold it I press ok and that's all you need to do if I just closed it you see the file it's already here and there you go thank you for watching this video take care and see you soon